Bell Jones quarterback, Mandarin High School, 2025. You're here at FSU's practice, uh, spring practice. What'd you kind of think? Uh, you got to see Jordan Travis, all these quarterbacks. What was that like watching? Uh, high intensity for sure. Uh, I just got to be hands on. I was on the field at all times. In every drill, right behind the quarterbacks, listening in and any and everything they had to say. It was just a great experience. I've never been this hands on. Have you had you been to an FSU practice before? Yes, okay. I was. I was here last year. It was definitely a different experience. Just flying around the ball was really different. Uh, just everything was just different. The, the coaching from Tony. Uh, what did you see? Kind of what he does with his quarterbacks. What does he do specifically when you watch them when they work? From their feet to their eyes to the throw. He's just really a developmental quarterback. I mean, he can develop can develop you in any and every way. I mean. Just, it's unexplainable. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure you've seen the development of Travis uh, Jordan through the you know the first year, second year, and now. What's kind of the big difference that you see with his development? What they've done with him? Tying his feet with his eyes, and then make, being able to make the throw, just go through his progressions. Mm -hmm. I think that's been a big part. We know he can run. We know he can escape with his feet. But just being able to stay in the pocket and deliver the ball accurately, that's what he's. Now, after watching these guys go through that with to Coach Tokarts, does are you? Does there anything that you're taking away from these practices that you want to work on oh, for when sure. you get back to campus? Yeah, for sure, because we run similar, similar things. So, things that they do on the field, I can bring back to my high school to make us better as a team. Anything like that. You told me well before Jamel that you know FSU was like number one. They were right at. It, have they extended that even stronger as far as you them being number one? Uh, <laughs> they have. I just, I've just i just never been through anything like this before. I mean, I was just so hands-on. I was just on the field. They wanted me to be there. They told me, you're on the field. We want you to be right there with all the quarterbacks. So I was, I was there. Is the decision process going to go for a while, or do you want to get it kind of over before you? I want to. I want to get it over with. Okay. I just want to. I just don't want to be so fast with it. I right. Right. Be right. patient. Make sure my decision. But I want to be only fast. Build the recruiting uh, class. So. Be. Are you um planning to do it like before your season starts, or is it going to be? Next yeah, season? It'll, it'll probably be before my season starts for sure. It'll just be when the right moment is. So you want to go ahead and commit before your junior season yeah. starts. Mm -hmm. All right, so it's still, like you said, it's still kind of early in the process. Yeah. I know the recruiting calendar speeds up, it seems like, every four, five or six mm -hmm. years. Uh, but who are some of the other programs that are involved in your recruitment? And not that there's obviously anything wrong with it, but uh, who else are you going to take on official visits to between um, now and the time you make your decision? If, if I do end up committing early before the summer, I won't be – going to any unofficial visit. There's just no reason to, so there's yep. time. But if I don't, it'll probably be Alabama, uh, Ohio State, Clemson, South Carolina, and I reckon you see. Now, will you take any unofficials this spring? Um, I'm supposed to go somewhere with myself on 17, but okay. uh, it'll probably be like LSU, Tulane, Georgia, so. A joke with John that you guys couldn't come back and you see Jameis Winston now on March 11th. Uh, you know, are you when you when you plan on coming back? Uh, probably for the spring game. Okay. If not for the spring, I'll definitely be down here for the summer. Game. Okay. I definitely just because I have the offer doesn't mean I want to come back in and camp and throw. I definitely throw. I want to work out. I want to compete with other quarterbacks around me. I want to make us better. I want to make them better. So. Is that is that a big deal for you to work with Tony just to kind of get a feel for him? It's, it's always is just to get his feedback, just for him to coach me. If I love when they coach me, if I love when Coach Norvell coaches me, mm -hmm. he's a great coach. So. As a staff, uh, I asked John this. I mean, what makes these guys so unique as a staff as a whole? What do they do that's different than, I guess, a lot of schools? They were very welcome. Today when we came in to visit, they were right there. Right there. Every, every coach was right there to comfort us and – they were right there at the door to uh, welcome us.